Hello everybody, welcome to the Mumbai version of the NTAT test happening right here at IIT Pawai. NTAT which is National Talent Acquisition Test which we are doing here for students across the country. I've got a few students who I'm going to talk to. So let's hear it from them, what they think about aptitude tests like this and of course internships and what internships mean to students. Actually, it's a very good idea because it gives practical knowledge and it will help the future students that to, uh, to gain, gain knowledge about the industries and what's going on. I think it's a good opportunity and getting at this platform while they are still studying and uh, some, some organization of this sort coming up to this level and giving them this big stage is a very good thing, like it's a good opportunity. And it's not only about exam, of course you can evaluate yourself, you can see where you stand right now at this point of time. You still have scope to make choices for future and uh, yes, experience is the biggest thing. It's really a good opportunity to have an internship letter in your hand when you go for in placement jobs and they, it's like a bonus in your CV to uh, get an internship letter. Being an undergrad, the one thing that comes up is experience. This experience which we'll get in an internship anywhere, no matter what the field is, it gives a, a lot of boost in co uh, handling corporate situations which will help us later when we actually find a job. Uh, internships are very important to have an experience for these uh, undergrads. Uh, it's like a little door from where they can you know, have a flavor of uh, the corporate world. So it's definitely very important to have this experience. My experience is experience more important hai, uh, rather than income or money. Whatever, because that experience we can't buy from the money. Internships are a great way to get like a prototype. You kind of grow up after working at an industry and you get a real experience. You know, book knowledge will not help you as everybody says. Do you think like uh, internship procedure helps other uh, faculties also? Like all of them engineering, I can understand it's a technical, it's a very um, informative and knowledge driven faculty, right? Uh, there are many other careers, maybe creative careers also. So do you think the whole process of internship helps those students also? Yes, obviously, because doing something and doing something under someone in the, the guidance is completely too different. So we have to get acquainted when we, you know, interact with the outer world. Would you go in for an internship with a startup which gives you a lot more exposure? Or would you go in for an MNC which gives you lesser exposure but a good stipend? I would definitely go for the startup because in the end you get to learn more. Like after 5 or 10 years you eventually will end up at an MNC. Because I feel that the startups are the places where you really learn as compared to like maybe an MNC where you just do a small project. Alright, so there are majorly a couple of them. Firstly, having the right attitude. So having a learning attitude wherein the student is willing uh, to learn the field from which they're coming from is very important. With the startup, you learn the entire, you know, the little bits and pieces where you wouldn't learn in an MNC. Secondly, having the technical knowledge. So knowing the subject is equally and even more important for them. So uh, it is very important to know each and every subject, each and every field they come from. Other internships के लिए उनको अच्छा stipend मिले, तो ज़्यादा बच्चे internships के लिए apply करेंगे. Do you think that is a factor which pulls uh, students towards internships? Uh, well, I would say it's a, it has to be a good balance of both. Of course, experience is the foremost priority here. This is one uh, period of time and an opportunity you won't get often. So the driving force should be uh, experience and not uh, the stipend. A basic decent stipend is also necessary so that they can pull off at least their traveling cost. And that's, they don't have to depend on their parents for that. this lovely girl here with me who has just given the NTAT exam. How did your exam go? It was quite good. The examination was okay. It's it's difficult also. It's not that easy. It was a different experience for me. Difficult and challenging. Once they understand their own uh, capabilities, it will be, it'll be easier for them to understand where they stand and then make the right decisions for internships and for a platform like a Switch Idea uh, which offers a lot of internships uh, across industries, across uh, MNCs, across startups, I think it's a great platform for students to explore more. Uh, 